At nearly 90 metres high, it dominates the Cheshire countryside. But Jodrell Bank is more famous for what you can't see. Since the late 50s, it's been monitoring radio waves from space. It tracked the launch of Sputnik, which led to the space race. Scientists say the funding cut would force its closure. For the North West and, in fact, for the whole of the UK, it's the most recognisable symbol of British science. Uh, there are some fantastic uh, physics and biology and life science facilities around the country, uh, but they tend to be in anonymous buildings, whereas the, the telescope behind me is a symbol of, of, of science in the UK. Jodrell Bank is part of the Merlin Group of telescopes which are linked together to provide unrivaled detail on distant galaxies. Britain pioneered this technique of getting high-resolution radio images by connecting telescopes together over long distances. And this eMerlin project is the culmination of decades of effort and pioneering work in that field. So to remove that facility now, of course, would damage our world standing. As well as its scientific use, Jodrell Bank is, of course, a Northwest landmark. Built in the late 1950s, it's now a listed building. But for many people, it's also their first introduction to science. The Lovell Telescope is named after its creator, who fought sceptics to get it built. He says it still has an important role to play. Of course, all good things come to an end, but nevertheless, I think that it would be a tragedy to close down the instrument at this stage. I, I feel that um, another 10 or 15 years, and then this closure might be justified, but not at the moment. Final recommendations on the proposed budget cuts are expected by the end of the month. Colin Sykes, Northwest Tonight, Jodrell Bank.